Right, Sean, you just tell me a bit about your, how you ended up at Cheltenham Town and then your outstanding memories from your time there. Right, well, I started off playing for Doughty Dynamos and uh, one day Dave Lewis came along and saw me play and he invited me up to training to go to Cheltenham. So uh, I went along, a bit daunted to start off with, you know, obviously going to a new setup, a lot more professional. And uh, he put me in, I started in the youth team actually at the Robins and done okay, went into the reserves. I uh, played there for a year and a half under Dave and uh, it was Dave actually put me in for my uh, debut against Frickley. That was uh, an interesting game to say the least. We uh, uh, had two players sent off. Uh, I scored my first ever goal, which was, you know, always stick in my memory. And uh, we went on to win 2-0, which was, you know, real, for, for me it was just like, highlight of, of my career really I was scoring on your debut because I wasn't a great uh, goal scorer so uh, we carried on that uh, year I played centre midfield I had a specific job to do uh, Dave then was caretaker manager and he left when Jim Barron took over uh, Jim again was completely different in the fact that he gave me a position in the team to stop the playmaker of the other team whoever we were playing against so Certain games I played in, I didn't feel as though I, I did as much as I should have been doing. But uh, Jim was happy. Jim just said, look, you know, you, they've got a star man. He makes him tick. You stop him playing. So uh, my job, I'd say, was to shackle their player. Jim was happy. I played two seasons, you know, doing more or less the same job. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it was, it was good. Jim was, Jim was really good influence. He was really encouragement. You know, he had the great, the training was superb and Jim. He just, uh, you know, again, encouragement-wise, he was superb. Yeah. He was superb. Yeah. When you look back, just the few players that sort of stand out that you played with at Cheltenham? Uh, again, the team was full of leaders at Cheltenham. You know, Bucky, for me, was my main player. You know, he, he, the encouragement he gave me, he'd been there, he'd done it, he was level-headed. You know, you couldn't really ask for it. He, you know, if anything was going wrong, which at times it, it did, he was coming back to me and saying, look, just keep your head up, work hard, it'll come. You know, yeah. and in hindsight, he was right. You know, he was the one player I, I always looked up to, who was uh, who gave me a lot of encouragement. Yeah. Mm. Right. Certain games we played in, like you know, obviously my, my debut was the big game for me. Uh, the other big game I think was Barnet away because they were a team full of, let's say, the the non-league England players. You know, Barry Fry in charge was a huge character he was, uh, and we beat them two 0 on the night. I think Steve Brooks scored two goals. And uh, the only time I've ever heard the whole Chatham Town team getting a man of the match, which was uh, got a little big round of applause, the whole Chatham Town team. So, yeah, that, they were real two games that stand in my memory. And uh, the only other goal I scored for Chatham was Bath, Bath away in the Cup, which uh, I scored after coming on a sub in that game. So, uh, yeah, you never forget the goals you score. Yep. Never forget. And, and just finally, how proud were you to play for Cheltenham, being a Cheltenham lad? Well, obviously, being a Cheltenham lad, it's always great to play for Cheltenham. You know, it's uh, tough, tough being a Cheltenham lad because you know you're bumping into people all the time. When when you didn't play well, they'd let you know. When you did play well, that's when I was sort of used to go out all the time when I did play well because I knew I'd be meeting people. But uh, yeah, it was it was just everything. It's just a privilege to play for Cheltenham. You know, it's just yeah. the proudest moment of my football career. Yeah, right, brilliant. Cheers, okay. Sean.